Today's rudiment is the single paradiddle. It's uh, one of the most basic rudiments. It's also one of the more coordination challenging at first, but once you get it, you'll have it forever. Single, single, double. When you switch, single, single, double. It's the logical extension of both the single stroke roll and the double stroke roll in that they alternate back and forth every two notes. And so if I play a few in a row, you start to see the pattern. The paradiddle is cool because the name paradiddle both tells you what it is you're supposed to play in sort of a roundabout way, and it has exactly the right number of syllables to help you remember how to play it. So para means beside. Two single strokes are beside each other. That's the para part. Diddle is drummer slang for a double stroke. So if you have a para and then a diddle, you have single, single, double. And that's all there is in a paradiddle. Also, paradiddle has four syllables. Paradiddle has four notes. So you can say paradiddle, paradiddle. A paradiddle has an accent on the first note. The other three are unaccented. And if you exaggerate that in the beginning, it'll help you remember it later. When we're playing the accented first note, it's good to start really high. Later, when we're actually doing it, we don't need to go so high, but just for coordination's sake, we'll start huge. And then basically, the nice thing about a paradiddle is that the, the double stroke at the end gives you two notes to get that other stick up there for the next paradiddle. And then you always know which hand to start the next one on. It's the hand that's up there. That's kind of ridiculous. Once you get the pattern, then you can play it small and it makes sense to you. Here are some slow paradiddles, and then I'll play some fast paradiddles. 